Howdy folks and welcome back once more to Let's Play Deus Sex. Today we are walking menacing. Covings were made by hand in Tibet. I should add to them. Take a look around. I assume this is who we want to talk to. We have many prize Buddhas you will observe. Okay. Mother Chow, Mr. J.C. Denton. In the flesh. As dark and serious as his brother. You know who I am. And Paul? You know my brother? Intimately. Call me Maggie. Paul never mentioned you. That is why he is still alive. He can keep a secret even from his own brother. But why... Paul told you about Majestic 12, correct? The conspiracy behind you, Natko? Just the name. Majestic 12 sent Paul to murder the former Red Arrow leader. And me too. And he double-crossed them? Rest to say, I persuaded him to join our side. What does Majestic 12 want with the Red Arrow? We are winning the Triad War against Majestic 12's ally, the Luminous Path. We were developing a new technology. You might have heard about a sword... The Dragon's Tooth, right? The Triad settle disputes in contests of skill, which includes the crafting of weapons. The Dragon's Tooth would have made us unstoppable. So Majestic 12, they're trying to tip the balance, give the Luminous Path a technological advantage. Exactly. I tried to warn the people of the danger, and the Luminous Path calls me a liar. The police have all the evidence they need to settle this. Locked up in the station at the Wan Chai Market, but they will not act. Go and see. I know the code to their vault. 87342. It's only fair to tell you that I spoke with Gordon Quick before coming here. I thought he was a friend of my brother's. I agreed to visit you and learn the truth of the situation. Yes, you were seen. The new Red Arrow leader is Max Chen, and you don't have to go to the Lucky Money for him to know your activities. Now tell me about Paul. Why did he not return? Paul's on his way to Hong Kong. I don't know when he will arrive. Then you must think for yourself. In Hong Kong, the truth is seldom kept in plain sight. Okay. Take a look around. I just want to get out of here. Away from that low hum. It's driving me nuts. Okay, apparently you can't really play piano. Can I destroy things? Ha-ha! <laughs> okay. Actually... Ah, oh, shit! Whoever's out there, give yourself up. Pass. <laughs> uh... I'd love to say that I knew this was here, but I didn't. I just saw something nifty and was like, I want to think. No. I am in beats. All right, jigs up. I have swords. We haven't even. Oh, God, one of them's got a fucking rocket launcher. Jesus. My hit point pool. It's you. Oh, my God. I got him. All right, lesson learned. Lesson learned. Sergeant, is that you? Yeah. You saw nothing. Perfect stealth. I don't. What the fuck even is this? Three tools, huh? Oh my fucking like Oh Jesus and I hit us. No, it is escape to close out of this, okay. I I keep like thinking that I hit escape to close out of them and it doesn't, but apparently it does. I 
serving you through this fascinating device in your skull. You have found the proof we needed. The Dragon's Tooth Sword. There, inside the glass case. If you wish to be my ally, you will retrieve the sword and await my instructions. I mean, okay. I'm gonna retrieve the sword. And I'm gonna do things with it. I don't know. <laughs> I totally forgot this thing was in here. I thought it was in just a completely different area. This is why we have all these multi tools. That's right. Render unto me! The Good. Beam now Saber! To Max Chin at the Lucky Money Club. If you can make peace among the triads, then perhaps I can help you in your difficulties. Oh, I'm gonna make peace. I'm gonna make peace! The permanent kind of peace that is only ever made by meeting out justice through totally not a lightsaber. Not a sword in the traditional sense, but a nanotechnologically constructed blade with a dynamically forged on command and a non utatic solid. Nanoscale wedding devices ensure that the blade is both unbreakable and lethally sharp. So the base damage on this is 100. The base damage of a Gep round by comparison is 300. This thing is doing more damage by far than any weapon we have. You can see that like our, our 762 is only 3 damage. Shotgun is 20. This thing is basically going to one shot any human enemy that we hit with it. It's pretty fucking great. Oh, yeah. Hi! I'm here. Did anybody else hear something? Hello? Hi. Now, fucking goddamn flame thrown sons of bitches. Take your shitty darts and go. Ah. Oh. Hit points. Oh. Tranked. Dart guns. Let me go on my sword based killing spree. No. Hi. To you, that fucker right there. Jesus. We're okay. Crossbow. PMA clip. Oh, pulse rifle ammo. Credit shit. Nothing else I really care too too much about. Go ahead and use some of these. Go ahead and drop this. Okay, so yeah. This thing is just like a ridiculously, ridiculously powerful, broken ass weapon that like, I don't even know. Like door strength 50. Oh, we can't open it. But there's something in there. And I would like it. So yeah, we're basically like full on god mode at this point. Okay, extra ammo. Uh, I'm gonna put that on our sniper rifle. Seven round magazine on it now. I can dig that. Switch, huh? Oh. How very convenient. There's sneaky exits and entrances everywhere. Okay. I'd like to be able to turn off the obnoxious squeaky lasers, but I guess we don't get that perk. Data cube. Uh. Okay. And you have one last finger. Oh. So MC. So I assume that that's her cutting somebody's fingers off. She seems like a bad person. So I'm very, very tempted to just kill her. I am going to go and taunt her. Hello, random maid. I will accompany you. To where? Where are you gonna accompany me to, huh? I have a lightsaber. Oh, she's gone. How convenient for her. Oh yeah, they do have fancy Buddhas too. Neat. Miss Chow. I wanna talk to you about your car's extended warranty. What did I do? No. 
cabinet too heavy to lift kitty come here kitty I want to make you into a hamburger man I could really go for a friggin hamburger I like hamburgers mirrors in video games We're breaking into her house at night and wrecking up the place. No way. Think Why? Why can we do this? It doesn't matter, we can. JC's in her house just letting that water run down his trench coat. Because... Hate cats. <sighs> Anyways, man, she's gonna have like the best story. So yeah, JC Denton broke into my house. He stole my mega weapon, <laughs> and he fucking killed my cat. <laughs> oh, I love video games. Oh. Welcome to Queen's Tower. All right. I have, where am I? What am I? I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing. Find Tracer Tong. Yeah, that'd be great. Uh, demonstrate her guilt to the Red Arrow by showing Max Chen the Dragon Tooth Sword. He is in the Lucky Money Club in the mall near. What? I think we were actually at that club last episode. Was this not okay. advisable for tourists to visit the canals at night? Why are you just standing here with a flamethrower, bro? How are you not immolating things with that? Lord knows I would be. What is this? Oh, that's for when I inevitably do a stoop and then fall down into the canal. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, game devs. You got my back. Hello, local man. I was walking here. Voice acting. Like, you can tell this was the point where they just got a bunch of developers and we're like, okay, we need you guys who've never done any voice acting and are going to have no direction whatsoever. Like, give me a Chinese voice, Ron. And Ron's just like, I don't even know what that means. And they're like, make your L's sound like R's. And everybody's just like, oh, it's probably a little bit culturally insensitive, but we're just a small little indie dev, what are you gonna do? Probably like fucking monsters down there or something. Those little green lizard things that spit bullshit at you. I don't wanna deal with it. I have better things to use my my newfound mega sword on. Okay, so it was Lucky Money. Alright, so yeah, it was over here. The mall area is perfectly safe. Okay. My trophy now! Except I don't even want it. Dude, you've got like the shortest legs in the world. <laughs> I love this game. If you want a good time, I recommend the lucky money. Okay, I mean that's why we're here. Ooh, delicious snack foods, med kits, money to be stuck. I don't even, we've got 36, we have so much money, it's not even funny. I can just pick the lock. I only have a camera. Probably ballistic glass if I had to get, eh, not worth it. Hmm, leather boots for you. 25 credits admission. Here you go. Perfect. I order you to stand in the spotlight and growl at the women like a dog who needs a master. Yeah, I'm gonna pass on that. Hello. I feel 
silly. You look mirrors good. in video games. A little more. There you go. Hello. All right. I'm here on business, not pleasure. Sorry. Sure. I know my needles. Dude, seek help. Have another drink? Don't mind if I do. As you were saying? Well, women back home, they aren't like your daughter. I do very much wish to meet her. You are very handsome. You must have many girlfriends in your country. Oh, come on. Nah. I am just a lonely otaku. Please don't isekai me into a much shittier game. Shit. Fuzz. Oh, can this thing break? Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't, couldn't remember if you could break metal crates with this thing. Apparently it's not that good. Lock strength 90. And the, the ground is like slippery here. Is it supposed to be ice? Because that's where they keep all their booze and chickens. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm not gonna make. <laughs> Never mind. I may be crude and have no taste, but I'm not that crude. Haha! <laughs> oh. Excuse me, sir. This room is off limits to club patrons. I suggest you leave. It's okay. I'm here to see Max Chen. He'll expect me. An American. I hope he likes what you have to say. Uh, is letting anybody back here these days. I mean, I do have a lightsaber. It's pretty cool. I wonder what would happen if you stuck this thing in water. Of course, the game doesn't care, but... What's up, dude? I got, like, a magic sword. So? I have found something in Miss Chow's apartment that might interest you. Is that so? The sword was never destroyed. It was stolen, and she is the one who stole it. Preposterous! I have it right here. But, Miss Chow? She works for a group called Majestic 12. She's using you and the Red Arrow for her own ends. No, you must be mistaken. Think about it. She murders your predecessor, hides the sword, pushes the Red Arrow into the war with the Luminous Path, and then, what next? The triads are weakened and an outside group seizes power. Sound far-fetched? Oh, there must be an explanation. Perhaps you should meet with the leaders of the Luminous Path. Hmm, perhaps. For now, take them this message. I will stop hostilities until I have completed an investigation. Boss, what is it? Marty at the door, so we have trouble. So just coming in. She said I was some kind of mechs. MJ-12 troops. They must have followed me. Mechs, you say? Say your business. Get out of my way, you stupid f fucker! <laughs> okay, I probably, I probably shouldn't have killed that dude. Just because my bloodlust was asking to be sated. What are we- oh shit, I think these dudes explode when they die. I can't remember, maybe not. These are like the hardcore, hardcore enemies of this game. One shot, of course, but still pretty dangerous. Not everybody. I guess that's everybody. Just go ahead. Thanks, buddy. I like bio cells and some fucking ballistic armor. I'm honestly mostly excited about the bioelectric cells. Because that's like... My god mode toggle. Anybody else? Okay. Uh... Alright, good talk. What's up, guys? What you got in here? Some smokes? A can of soda? Alright. Nope. Pick it up. Ooh. All right, let's get back to where we, where we were. I'm trying to remember where that dude was that gave us. I don't know if there's gonna be enemies meandering about. I don't think there will be, but why wouldn't you be walking around with a lightsaber? Get a fucking lightsaber! Oh my god! 
I need to not just abuse this thing for the entirety of the game, but I'm pro probably going to abuse it for the entirety of the game. What's up, buddy? You're right. Maggie Chow is a con artist. You have proof. Yes, I found the sword in her apartment. Good. Inform the Red Arrow Dragonhead. Then we will see who is the real traitor. I've already been to the Lucky Money. Max Chen has declared a truce between the Red Arrow and the Luminous Path. A truce? Are you certain? Majestic 12 attacked the club. I think he would consider forming an alliance. Mr. Denton, you are the man I hoped you were. Tracer Tong is inside, in his laboratory below the compound. The door is in our sparring room. He will know what to do next. To enter our compound, use the code 1997. A very good year. Doggy! I will spare you. And we're of course going to poke around here. While you are here, observe the laws of the triad. I don't know what those are, but okay. Not that I think you guys could enforce them, but hey, you know what? Do not interrupt us with questions. Fucking love the music here so much. You must have won great favor with the dragon head. See, if I were a tracer tong, which one of you would I be? Somebody's hiding a book under their pillow. What you got? Journal of Hong Kwan Gordon Quick. Oh. Today, Master Tong has informed me we will have visitors. None of you guys look like a Tracer Tong to me. Tracer Tong admitted another American. Perhaps you know him. If Tong decides he'll trust you, you'll be free to come and go as you please. God, that fucking voice acting is so bad. <laughs> All right. You must be JC. Tong will see you now. Okay. Paul Denton. Yes, a reliable man. So your kill switch has been activated. I feel fine, but it's been over 16 hours. See how easily our technologies turn on us? The more power you think you have, the more quickly it slips from your hands. Can you do something about it? That will depend. You, like your brother, are an extraordinary piece of technology. I never pass up the chance to try a new blade, but I fear at the crucial moment I may lift up my arm to strike and you will twist free of my grasp. In other words, I'll owe you a favor. Indeed, as will your friend Mr. Jacobson, a man of much useful knowledge. He arrived in Hong Kong shortly after you did. I was forced to keep him in custody until I could verify his identity and his loyalties. I assume he checked out. I believe he is sincere. Now, go down the stairs to the operating platform, and I will examine your systems. But first, yoink, yoink, and... Anything else valuable hidden in here? Not really. Plasma rifle, wicker basket, full of snakes. Application clip size, 20 millimeter H, fucking grenades, what? There's a 
Is there a grenade launcher in this? I do not remember that at all. There's something hazardous down here. Rustic armor I don't care about. Rockets. Alright, let's get this kill switch pulled out of us. Ah! Robot! What's up, buddy? Okay, where am I? Please, complete your business and then go. They have a human skull just sitting on a table. I assume this is where I'm supposed to stand. And then our head explodes. Success. Come back to the control room. All right, that wasn't too bad. Electrocuted the ever living shit out of me, but hey, you know, I'm a robot. Oh, hey, it's Alex. You took a big risk following me here. Thanks. When you believe in something, you just gotta do it. How'd you find Tom so quickly? Turns out I knew him all along. TTUndernet.0924.243.886. I posted a message to the board and he contacted me himself. Any news from Jaime? No sign of him yet. I hope he made it. Yeah, me too. Did you ever dig up anything about this Daedalus character? I'm still hearing from him. Actually, I did, sort of. Crypto says Daedalus was supposedly a government AI project, also known as Echelon 4. Supposedly? I'm getting this from anonymous crypto boy. Daedalus was supposed to be the old content recognition problem in surveillance. It was a program that could search all the terabytes of intercepted messages for subversive content. So, what happened? Never panned out, as far as I know. The problem was just too hard. They do it for a lot of taxpayer money, but finally had to scrap the whole project. So the thing that's talking in my head is, what, uh, resurrected AI? I wish I knew. Fucking robots, man! It's AI all the way down! No escape. Robot. Uh, now we're okay. Good to know. All right. Now we have more conversing to do with Tracer Tongue, but I think we are going to go ahead and save that for next time. So as usual, folks, thank you for watching. I hope you had a good time, and I will see you all next time. We're in Conspiracy Continues. Robots. Lightsabers. Until then. Hey, you made it to the end. Nice. You had a good time. Check out one of these other series. See if you like them. Drop a like, comment, or subscribe if you'd like to support the channel, be the machine and all that. As always, thanks for watching.